three things that changed after my parents' divorce. First of all, divorces are messy. They're hard, heartbreaking. There's no way to put them into something beautiful or, you know what I'm saying? Like, reality is a lot of things change after your parents get divorced. And one thing that I learned is that it was a little bit glorified, not glorified, but the way that I was explained that things were gonna go is not the way that they went. So this is me being honest, be real, even though it might be a little hard to hear. The first thing that changed after my parents divorce was expenses were cut back extremely. We were used to being spoiled all the time and we were used to going out to eat all the time. We were used to expensive clothes and brand name stuff and not even brand name stuff. I'm not talking about Gucci or anything like that, like Hollister and freaking I don't know, mall clothes. Um, once my parents got a divorce, we cut back on a lot of expenses because it was just my mom working and Naturally, you know, at that age, I was young. I was like nine, 10 years old, you know, like I, I didn't understand that. Uh, we were extremely spoiled. I had iPads and computers and a lot of stuff that was unnecessary. <laughs> but we did cut back on a lot of expenses after my parents' divorce. Naturally, because we only had one source of income and my mom was a single mom and she worked her ass off to get what we needed to in the house and we focused on surviving and food to be honest <laughs> all the extra fancy stuff was like out the door so first thing that changed was finances they're very different after a divorce second thing that changed after my parents divorce and i'm just being real guys because i know is the relationship with my father changed i know that when parents get divorced, they obviously want to tell their kids like, oh, nothing's going to change. Like, he's still going to see your father. He's still going to be part of your life. Well, he is. Like, I'm not saying that my dad's not a part of my life. He is. And I love my dad. And I love the relationship that we've built and that we have. But it's very different. The relationship with my father did change. Not having him around 24-7 just because Obviously, when I was growing up and as a child, you need your mother more. And my dad didn't give full custody of us. My mom did. And even though they would go around the weekends and spend time with him, it's different. It's very different. So it's ridiculous for somebody to come and tell you that everything's going to stay the same after a divorce. It's not. <laughs> it's hard and it's different. And like I said, I love my father and I love the relationship that we have. But the relationship with my father that I've built and I have now, it's more on a mature and, you know, person to person human level. It's not so fairy tale like, you know, like I see him as a human being. He's made mistakes, you know, he's not perfect. It's a beautiful relationship, but it is very different, okay? And I'm not saying that, um, you know, it can't be fairy tale like. It can, but. Things change after a divorce. That's the cold truth. That's it's facts. <laughs> Third and final thing that changed after my parents' divorce is that we no longer celebrate holidays like we used to. Um, things are a little different. My brother and I, we both work and my parents work and we're not always able to get together and have those big gatherings during the holidays and, you know, uh, cook together and have the meals and you know what I'm saying like the whole shebang like it's different it looks different it's very meaningful to us and I love my family and I love what we have but it's different we usually have to plan like days ahead whether we are able to spend those days together like Thanksgiving Christmas we've never really been big on Thanksgiving so more Christmas because that's what's meaningful to us but the time that we do spend together we we try to make it meaningful but it's not like we know that christmas is coming and we're gonna run out to the tree and there's gonna be presents underneath and you know the whole fairy tale like and magic of christmas is i've gotten older i feel like has faded 
as for a lot of us because we realized hey santa's not fucking real like my parents are working their asses off for these presents underneath the tree it looks very different now so holidays have definitely changed after uh, my parents divorce um they, they're beautiful like i said and they're very meaningful they're just different and those that's just the the truth uh, with divorces a lot of things do change and i am so glad i would never take back the divorce i would never want my mom to have stayed with my father because it wasn't really working out for them you know and i do feel like things change people change and i feel like one thing that i've learned from their divorce is to see my parents as human beings and understand them and love them on a different level it's much deeper i don't see them and glorify them just because they're my parents they're human beings they've done the best that they can and they were raised very different than they raised me you know uh so it's a beautiful thing, but it's also hard. And that's the truth. And you have to accept that to be able to work through it. You know what I'm saying? So if your parents are going through a divorce or anybody is going through a divorce, it's going to be okay. It's beautiful in its own way, but it's hard. And that's the cold truth. And you have to accept the fact that it's hard and it's going to be different. There's going to be a lot of changes that are going to be very uncomfortable. But in the end, it's a beautiful thing because something else arises relationships in a new way even with your parents so thank you so much for watching this video make sure that you subscribe and like if you enjoyed it if you learned something new and if you are living on planet earth i expect you to hit that subscribe button to be part of my family and keep up with new videos every monday blessings my lovelies Mwah.